Hi, I'm Sam from the Tudor Royalty Experience and the Tudor Queen's Wardrobe. Um, a lovely customer of, my, customer of mine has asked me to explain the two French hoods that I sell and how they go on. This is not historically accurate in the sense of the way my hair is um, and I should have a, a linen coif over the top, but for just a demonstration purposes, I've got a hair, my bun in my hair. I'm going to start with the full French hood, which is made to the Tudor Taylor's pattern. I highly recommend it if you want to give it a go yourself to make. Their pattern's fantastic and it's based on, on their research and historically accurate. It's all in one piece with the veil and the bilaments and the, there is the back here, there is ribbon that join the two back bits together so that you can get a tighter fit. I wear a bun on top of the head when I wear the full French hood because it stops it from moving backwards. So I shall put it on for you now. You can see how simple and straightforward that is. It just goes over the bun there. And at the back here, if you need to, you can tighten the ribbons to fit as loose as you want or as tight as you want. I say without being able to actually see what I'm doing. <laughs> and that should hold firm. Now, if you're still a little unsure of it staying on your head, I would recommend you use some corsage pins like these and just pop a couple into the hair bun, through the veil. And believe me, you can run around all day and it won't, won't move. So that's how I put the full French hood on. I will now demonstrate, this is the theatrical French hood, as I call it, which is a much simpler design, much more lightweight, um, and it's more for people going to a fancy dress parties or theatrical use, etc. This is based on an Alice band, so it's very easy to put on and very, yeah, very lightweight, and anyone can wear it with short hair or long hair or even no hair, need be. This is Annie, and I'm gonna demonstrate how to put it on from her. Best way I say is to put your hair in a ponytail if you have long hair. I put my hand up through the veil, grab the ponytail through the veil just so it's out the way, and then pop the hood on to the head. And as you see, you can just mess around with it and use it and move it around as you see as you please to it's comfortable. And that's it, you're done. So I hope that's a little bit informative for you and um, see you again soon. Bye.